No Guts, No Glory, Mr. That Is, me and me alone. That's it. Not her this time. So, we got up today. We're just putting around and we're thinking, you know, we haven't been down to Lincoln for a while. So, we did a little bitty road trip and went down to Lincoln and this is kind of a little conglomeration. Uh, after after I get done showing you everything, make sure you stay uh, complete, completely watching the video because at the end uh, she's going to post a lot of pictures that she took at you know Goodwill and Kroger's and the places that we were at. So this is going to be a bit of a conglomeration, but it's mostly Kroger's because we got up and we knew that the Kroger's in Lincoln they're they're going to close two more stores in uh, Illinois here. They just, oh, maybe three or four months ago, they closed a couple of them in Peoria, a couple of Kroger's. I don't know what's going on. I know I know the ones in Peoria, why they closed them. They were having a high theft rate in that area, and, you know, they weren't getting a lot of business. But the one in Lincoln, uh, it really baffles me. I think it was a rent, a rent situation to where the rent was too high, but they didn't fight to stay there and get the rent lowered or anything that I know of and and then another one's going to close in Decatur so you know their their loss I guess is our gain as far as it goes for deals so we went down there and thought we did a Dollar Tree down there I thought well I'll get her out and we'll go to Goodwill and Dollar Tree and uh, Kroger's and we'll get a bite to eat so that's what we did so we're back now and I'm going to show you what we got. Didn't get a whole lot of stuff, but we did get some good deals. So let's go ahead and get started and like I said, make sure you look at all of the pictures at the end of some of the stuff that she took pictures of and she'll post them at the after this video. So let's move right along. Let's get into Kroger's then. And well, let me do the Goodwill. We did the Goodwill walked around there <laughs> I took it <laughs> I took it there for her but who's the only one that bought something <laughs> me and there's the goodwill bag and I bought myself a brand new I mean they're brand new Wrangler sandals because the sandals I've got on that I really like they're starting to break on me so that's what Brad got all right and let me tell you if there's also a uh, Russell Stouffer's at the exit there when you get off the interstate there's a Russell Stouffer store and my dad called me while we were down there and he said oh man did you eat at the Bonanza I said no not this time but we go down there all the time and eat a Bonanza and he says well we were just down there and, and we also stopped at the Russell Stouffer, Stouffer Russell Stouffer store say that one real fast and he says can you stop back there at Russell Stouffer's and get me some of their saltwater taffy he says it's a variety bag and he says, get me another bag of that because I really like it. I said, no problem. And it was $3.99 for the bag of saltwater traffic. Okay, let's get into uh, the Kroger's. So, we'll show you that. Okay, almost all of this, I think almost all of it, except the bananas, they were $0.41 cents a pound, so that's pretty much a good one sale by whatever but everything else we bought was clearance so she saw these and she's never had them and it's uh, glucerna shakes and she thought well I'm gonna give that a try because the normal price on them was like ten dollars ridiculous but they had these in the clearance section for two forty nine so we grabbed those and, and remember, you get uh, gas, Kroger gas points, even though it's, you know, so that helps just a little bit. So you're still getting a really good deal. 
and she got for a dollar seventy nine this cleanser and my grandson and I guess maybe even my daughter for this situation but they had it's a huge bottle this thing is 34 ounces and if anybody knows that Dr. Teal's is a name brand and this is super moisturizer avocado oil foaming bath so we got that for her and it even smells good so that's a big bottle and it was only oh my gosh dollar thirty nine and I think the regular price I can't remember it showed showed it on the shelf it was a lot of money I don't know like six or seven dollars I'm guessing and they had fifty percent off all of their candles mmm this one smells good pumpkin nutmeg pie okay and they were normally I think five dollars let's see we got the candle for two dollars and twenty four cents is what that cost because everything was 50% off in that particular shelving aisle there at that unit all right and they were just marking them down when I got there so I bought one two three boxes of the fully cooked Oscar Mayer bacon and look at the price a dollar forty nine really good that's about half price for those so I got two for us one for my daughter and also I got two for my daughter and one for us of the Eckridge Franks they had them on markdown so I got three of those uno dos tres and they don't expire until October 7th so two more months before they're even expired so I got those three packs two for my daughter one for us and they were only 69 cents so another great buy then I saw these the Johnsonville stadium brats and they are not expired yet either they're good until October 19th of 2018 take a guess wow a dollar a dollar for a six pack of the Johnsonville brats alrighty we also got two of the Sanders chicken cordon bleu and they were on clearance for $2.49 and there's two in each pack in the frozen section so that was a, a good deal and the last item we got is a Tyson no antibiotics ever it's a dinner kit it's four cheese chicken and broccoli pasta five dollars what and 29 cents and it's a big bag I mean it's got great big chicken breast in it it's 38 ounces it's two pound 2.37 so it's two and a third pounds for that so that also was a great bargain so we're gonna probably one more time go back there because they close at the end of the month and maybe they'll start marking down a bunch of stuff in the aisles the aisles had some sales and stuff but you know a, a maybe a third of it was half price the rest of it was still pretty much full price so we'll let them keep marking down marking down marking down and then we'll go in another week or so and see what it looks like so remember stay tuned for the pictures that are at the end of this video and this is my haul no guts no glory mister that is let go, let God, and we'll talk to you the next time.
See you later. Bye.